What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna be playing Alan Wake 2 again and for some reason I feel like uh, this might be the final level but still we're gonna make it a part 9 I think so. Yeah part 9 part 9. Anyway let's get started. That did it. We need to talk. <sighs> Damn right. Lots for me to explain. Yes. But not here. The night's got ears. We can have our talk in your head. You have a room there, right? How do you know about that? I'm your grandfather. <laughs> what don't I know? Okay, let's take a look at the tour. You know about my mind place? How is that possible? We all have the power. Find the truth. Damn right I do. Odin already told you you're a seer. You can gaze into their heads, see the truth. See past the lies. Past this bullshit horror story. Us Andersons aren't bound by it. You can fight it. Don't be the story. Make the story. It's true. That's actually a good point. I am a seer. I have a power. My mind place is more than I thought it was. This isn't my intuition. I'm seeing their thoughts. Is this why I know the truth about Logan? While well, everyone else forgot? You know oh. about my mind place? I have the clicker. Can I use it to save my daughter? I am. Get your guitar roaring and your drums crashing. Blow reality's eardrums. Just the light switch isn't enough. It's Tom's story we're dealing with, so he's got to be the one to rewrite it. After that's done, he can flick that switch to bring the whole thing home, baby. I can't use the clicker without Wake. That's in it, Alan. Meaning Wake. He needs to rewrite the story first. Oh, by the way, guys, this is a the horror story without him. By the way, guys, this is a special video because today is actually my birthday. So let's do this. You said you so I might make this video two hours since today is my birthday. Why wasn't I told about you? And also because I have a new chair and this is going to be comfortable. Horror story. I was a shitty fucking dad to Freya. Your mom didn't deserve that. Not one bit. Yeah, yeah, finally. Things were said and done. Not a day goes by I haven't regretted it. But that fucking father of yours didn't make things any easier. Okay, okay, okay. I know Freya is gone. So I need to apologize to you. I am sorry, Saga. I can see he's sorry. Mom said she didn't want anything to do with my grandfather. And that my father died before I could remember. It all matches. Tor and Odin are part of my family. Ah, I thought they were just drunk. Anyways, I have to take a bathroom break real quick. I'll be right back. I guess so. The bathroom breaks. You said you were my grandfather. If that's true. Why wasn't I told about you? You were part of our fucked up family. Uh, way before the... Okay, now the father. Mom wouldn't talk about my father. You knew him? Some doors are better left closed. Your dad was a complicated bastard. Always thinking too many steps ahead. That's not how we work. There was trouble and... Then he was gone. I didn't handle it well. Freya didn't want anything to do with me after that. I can't blame her. I never knew my dad or my mom's family. So many broken relationships in my past. I won't lose mine. With Logan. With David. I won't stop until they're safe. 
Okay, now the mom. You said you were a shitty father to my mom. Is that why she left? Freya never looked back. My girl was strong. Freya always thought our powers had a dangerous side. Odin and me did fuck with things that should not have been fucked with. Your mom had common sense. She raised you right. Kept you safe. I'm not surprised she didn't tell you about the Anderson power. She was always protecting me. Whenever I told my mom about my mind place, she called it make-believe. I wish she'd been more honest with me. At least towards the end. Thanks for telling me this, Tor. I need to go find Wake. To stop this. The old gods of Asgard will be ready to help. Me and my bro will bring the rock when you need it. Remember, your daughter is alive. Just kept from you by this bullshit horror story. I needed to hear that. Thanks, Grandpa. Don't worry about me, kiddo. I'll drag my sorry ass over to Odin. The Anderson's finest will fix us both up. See you soon, Saga. See you soon. The FBC is holding Wake at the Sheriff's Station. I need to make Agent Estevez understand. They have Wake and I have the Clicker. We have to work together to stop this. Get the Clicker to Wake and make him fix his attempt to play God. That's the plan. But the FBC have him. So I need to go to the FBI's headquarters so i know where that is i know where that is yeah i'll go there but i need a car i need a car to go to bright falls where am i gonna find the car i didn't even drove here i just walked So guys, anyways, yes, today is my birthday. I'm finally going to be turning 18 years old. So, that means I'm going to have to start driving. And no, I'm not going to be getting money from like a dad, dad or something. Because my dad, he is still alive. And I'm also, and again, I'll start driving. And I'm also not going to go to the strip club. Ugh. Okay, but where do I actually go? I don't know where to go now. Hold on. Okay, so I looked at YouTube again, and there is a back gate for the for to go to Bright Falls. It's right over here, so I need to go, go, go. And also, if you're wondering, yes, I have a new chair over here. It's actually really comfortable. It's from Novel Desk. No, they're not sponsoring this video, but I would like a sponsor. I haven't had, I never had a sponsor before, and I would like to have one, like at least from a small company. All right. Okay, uh, here, 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 here.
Let's see if I'm going the right way. Yes. So I think I want to make this video two hours. Okay, let's go to let's play as Alan Wake for a bit and then we'll go back as Saga. Okay, now I'm back in the studio. And I'm locked in. So I think I should be on TV. And I'm back at Mr. Doors. One door. I don't have time for this, so let's get it over with. Tell me, was this all fake? A show? No one said otherwise, Mr. Wake. It was to indulge you, but we can stop pretending now. Uh. Masks come off. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I don't even think you know who's under your mask. But you know how to make things difficult for yourself. All these rules. Endless, convoluted loops you insist on going through. You are so lucky. You know. There are so many people helping you. Armies of people. Myself. Your wife. Don't mention Alice. Alice. I need to get to her. She's in danger. She is. Because of you. And so is someone important to me. Someone you pulled into this. You keep opening doors. Peeking in. Reaching through to get what you want, and that puts you in my path. I don't know what you're talking about. I have to go now. Maybe you will make it through this time. This has gone on long enough. This and our night springs, it was a nice distraction. It's time someone gave me a straight answer here. Next time we meet, the circumstances will be very different. And you would do well to return the favor by playing your part. Or stay out of my way, Mr. Wake. Whatever you say. Zane, the masks were finally coming off. Was it a sign I was closer to escaping? I had no time to waste.
Jumā, wow, na tad tev jau close top. E bota kon var set the Already? To get to Parliament Tower, I needed to find a murder site. Zane would know where to find one. Look at Zane. Uh, look for Zane at the hotel. Zane's room 665 was upstairs. The elevator would take me there. Reception who got me a room number. Hmm. Six six six. He had requested that room specifically. The devil had a sense of humor. Or he really didn't. It was funny either way. According to the director, the actor hadn't mingled with the rest of the cast. He had only come out for the play. And always in character. What, what do I do? Okay, so I feel so he said to take the elevator. So we need to find the elevator. Hold on. Okay, I think I figured out something. But first, we need to go back to the lobby. Because he said that we got to take the elevator. So, we need, like, the lobby to work. So, here. Yeah. Or maybe it's, it can still work. There we go. Let's 
hope nothing pops up. Oh. There it is. Something told me Zane wouldn't be happy to see me this time. Try anything, I will shoot you in the head. Scratch wrote return, not me. You're a fucking liar. You've given up. You stopped writing. You said it was too dangerous that, that we didn't deserve to get out. And then he showed up. Scratch. He promised to write. To get me the hell out of here. He was magnificent. A visionary. Turn and left me behind. It's still here, and so is he. I know I fucked up. But you can still catch him before he gets out, before he gets to your wife. Huh. When you get to him, don't hesitate. Kill the bastard for what he did to us. There's a murder site in my cinema. Where my film Nightless Night is playing. Oh, God. What? Oh, sh oh, I told you not to try anything. Oh. Yeah, actually, uh, now I can't go. Oh mercy! Thousands have gone missing beyond the labyrinth of me. When you're lost, you're lost in your own company. That is drama. What the fuck? I agree. I questions about Zane, but I had more pressing concerns. Zane's film. I had to find the movie theater poet cinema. The next murder site was there. Zane had created the film in tandem with Return to escape the dark place. Okay, so we need to get out of the hotel and we're supposed to go to like the theater. So where is the elevator? Where? 
chosen to pursue the cult, or had they chosen me for some unknowable purpose? To be a like. demon, to sort mm. the clues based on my interpretation, to change that which I observed. It was all a play, shadows on the wall of the cave, an echo of the true events that happened somewhere else. Was I there to watch the shadows, or was I a shadow too? In a performance. You know what, this video is actually going to be an hour long. Someone else. And maybe, maybe tomorrow will be too much. Too much. You know what, I'm just going to make every video one hour. And then the final part, I'll just make it two hours like I did with Miles Morales and Spider-Man 2. Actually, in Spider-Man 2, it was three hours and Miles Morales was just two hours. So, yeah. And the uh, regular Spider-Man 1, it was only one hour. Yeah, I only did those because I wanted to play Spider-Man 2. Yeah, I, did, I, pl I only played those games just so I could play Spider-Man 2. That is drama. I had to find the movie theater Poet Cinema. The next murder site was there. Zane had created the film in tandem with Ruben to escape the dark place. that happened somewhere else was i there to watch the shadows or was i a hey, hey. To set up for someone else
Okay, I think I'm going to continue. Okay, I really want to play a Saga so we can get Island back, but nah, I want to continue this. So this is honestly confusing because I have no batteries. Wait, hold on. Let me just go under here to subway. And let me, and let me see if I could find like some extra batteries in here. Okay, I think I'm gonna go back as Saga. But I think I just wanna like continue this. Side. The theater appeared to be closed. Maybe the ticket could still get me in. Yes. Lobby. The cinema lobby was a gateway to other realities on the silver screen. I could set a scene here. surface from the dark with their depraved acts of violence and fade back into the night, leaving behind bloody crime scenes and clues heavy with obscure meanings that led nowhere. Arriving at the cinema, I felt a monumental, terrifying revelation trembling before me, ready to open its jaws and swallow me whole. This place had significance to the cult. There was something to use there. I mean... well. The first step toward the murder site, I was making progress. Someone had barricaded themselves in the room.
Did I stop writing at some point? I can't stop. There's too much at stake. I needed a new draft of the story. One that would get me... Hold on, where am I supposed to go? Missing something. Uh -huh. I needed a new draft of the story. I needed a new draft of the story. One that would... I needed a new draft of the story. One that would get me ahead. ceremony or so we made our new members believe two of new york's finest they had performed endless favors to earn their place among us we had something special waiting for them and something very special for you alex casey who's your leader alan wake hmm? scratch zane give me a name You will meet him soon enough. There was no end to the corruption. It fit the genre, so I'd use it. I need to... Bismillah. What the hell happened here? cinema a rising star coming to america from finland but he only created one film tom the poet before he went missing mirroring the vanishing of the main character in the movie played by himself the biggest mystery was around his lost film an early work made in finland nightless night rumored to have mystic properties 
Some claimed it was a snuff film, that the ritual murder in the film was an actual murder. There were no known surviving copies, but the cult chased it as if it were their unholy grail. Just like Wake's books were. Okay. I needed a new draft of the story. One that would get me ahead of school. Let's see what this is. I need to change the plot. I needed a new draft of the story. One that would get me ahead of scratch. Okay, this sucks better. The cops had gotten their 15 minutes of fame with the cult, and it had been a scream. They were the murder victims. I had to find a way into the projection booth somehow. Sorry about that, guys. I was just getting a gift from my brother, so now let's continue. I think we need to go up over here. I think we need to fix the plot. I actually have an idea. Hold on. Okay, so. and hoods pretending to be a secret society maybe it is you who's playing a role mr casey a role carefully laid out for you a puppet blindly performing the ritual steps for the glory of the cult huh what the fuck have you been smoking nightless night a clip of the lost film survived you will see mr casey in the nightless night you will finally see Nightless Night was Zane's film. It played a role in this story. Okay, hold on, let me check. Okay guys, so I'm in the right spot. Let me just go to the plot board. And here. Clips of the lost film. Now let's watch this. What is this? Out of the screen and revealed the door. That looks like Johnny Depp. Wake. 
Oh. I was back out into the night. The seedy alley away from prying eyes was a good scene for dark deeds. In the city trapped in eternal night, they watch the film where the night never arrives, where the night hides in your mind. Flash grenade! I need that. this initiation do you nah, I'm sure we'll just chant some ceremonial stuff N nothing to it well it's about time we paid our dues made plenty of their problems disappear dumped all those nobodies down that chute what we did or didn't do it's all behind us now we're going straight to the top partner yeah like we died and went to heaven Okay, now I see the What? Find the answer on the plot board. I was making progress. Okay, so now I have an idea. Actually, the YouTube video gave me the idea. Okay, good. Now we can continue this. 
Oh wait, actually guys, hold on. Alright okay, guys, so I had to call my chef to, to, to for my dinner. I'm gonna be having chicken alfredo. The way he makes chicken alfredo is delicious and probably makes sense because the straight to the top. The dirty cops. They had committed repulsive deeds to get there. They told oh, me it was worth it. Ghost. It could not be opened on the side. Mr. Casey, I'm all yours. Go ahead. Ask that burning question in your mind. How did you do it? How did you get me into that film clip without my remembering it? Talk to me, damn it! You've seen the film? Good, good. Now you're ready to meet the Grand Master. He's waiting for you in the projection booth where everything will be revealed, where he will project a new reality onto this one. And now, Mr. Casey, I've played my part to the end. No, no, no! Crazy bastard! Why'd he jump? The projection booth. Was that where I find the murder site? Grandmaster. What? Damn, this game looks amazing. I love this game. So I love this game so much. I picked the right game to do this series on.
Ah! Shit. myself in a maze of film equipment. There had to be a way to the projection booth from here. Oh. I wasn't alone. Show yourself. Crazy man, my hands. You're a clown in a mask. Back where I started. A loop within a loop. I had to keep going. The Casey in the story was losing it. I wasn't far behind. Oh. Back at the beginning again. I had to keep going. Find a way to the murder site. Show yourself. Who said that? That's a real clever trick, asshole. You can run, but you can't hide. You're gray head mask in my hands. You're a clown in a mask. I'm not the one wearing a mask here, you moron. Why don't you come here and say that to my face, buddy? Never see who's the moron. Oh, there it is. Oh, 
Oh. Okay. I was back at the beginning again. Damn it. I had to keep going. Okay, but this time it's different. Site. I'm here, you son of a bitch. Show you. <laughs> Casey, I only play him in the movies. He's just a fictional character. What, what? What's going on here? You don't have to kill me. You don't have to go get that knife and stab me. You can just give up and go back. Forget about the ritual sacrifice. Oh no! Oh no! You don't. You'll be sorry. Oh. What the fuck? Yeah, exactly. Red Falls. I was getting close. Come on, Alex Casey. You've done well. You've played your role perfectly. Everything out of your mouth is a damn lie. The only place any of this makes any sense is in your psychotic brain. There's a fictional character in a story. You've fulfilled your purpose. You brought the writer of the story here. You can go now, Casey. No, no, no. I'm not going anywhere before I get some answers. How was I in that movie? How, why does all this feel so familiar? What? Who the fuck are you? Who the fuck? Fuck am I? No! And welcome to you, Alan Wake. What the hell? This is the ritual to lead you on. We are just one step away from your final destination, Mr. Wake. But first, here is an unanswered mystery for you. If Casey was fictional, and you assumed his role as a detective. Are you now fictional too? Whose story are you living? Mr. Wake. The visions were getting under my skin. Coming too close for comfort. Not a separate layer, but mingling with my own reality in the dark place. What? Wait. Dead end. This can't be right. Did I miss something? Oh, that's what this game is about. Unexpected stuff. I need to learn how to crouch. Eh, never mind, it's just auto murder site. Oh! The mask was the key. I'm scratching my balls, just the uh, just my legs. Oh, this is how I could help her. Saga. Saga Anderson, listen, I I've been tricked. Scratch wrote returned. I, I tried to fix the story, but he stopped me before I reached the end. He has it now. It's the key to escape. What do you mean, escape? He could have played with Scratch. I need to stop him. I need to stop him before he gets out. He's after Alice. I'm still trapped, but I'm making progress. I wrote you in to be the story's hero. Scratch made a horror story. I need to match the genre. It has to be dark, but the hero can break through, save her family, save us all. Save her family. Are you talking about my family? Yes. Whatever you're doing, it's working. You just need to keep going. Did we have uh, family in the horror story? I was closer now. Closer than ever before. But there was no time to lose. Everything was hanging in the balance. I could still lose it all. 
And we're back to the hotel. Let's see what we get from Alice. I had to make it work this time. I could stop Scratch, get the manuscript, fix its ending. End of part. I have more questions now than at the start. The irony of being trapped in a postmodern detective story. I felt watched. The eyes of some unseen audience on me. I wanted to turn to the hidden camera and tell them to fuck off. But I didn't know where to look to break the fourth wall. There would always be another case for Casey. A million also guys I'm not gonna record tomorrow because to welcome me I walked into her arms roll credits I'm not gonna record tomorrow because I'm gonna be taking a break because Sunday is my day off of YouTube misguided sense of honor and justice in a city where there can never be justice. Was ringing again. Somehow I sensed it wasn't Zane this time. It's closed. Uh -oh. No, the building was condemned, closed up. Something was wrong. Something was missing. I had to get inside. Okay, let's go back to Saga. Right. Um, yeah, let's go back to Saga. Okay, I'm gonna end the video here now. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe. And also tomorrow I'm not gonna record because I'm gonna take a day off. So bye-bye.